breathtakingly beautiful and the landscape captured and the moments captured i think for me the whales oh my gosh the whales swimming together and seeing the detail of like the tails um just what that was absolutely my favorite part i was just like jaw on the floor uh watching this film um incredible job just the quality of it was so 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 high and the voice of the narrator oh oh my gosh just an incredible narrator with an incredible voice that just resonates like in your chest um this this piece was so special and so um like epic in quality, uh, for lack of a better word. What set this film apart for me is that I felt as if I were actually on the sea voyage. The footage was so dramatic, from shots of the two lovely boats to crystal clear shots of the gorgeous ice and bright blue water and the incredible wildlife footage, most notably of penguins and whales. Wow. I particularly love the reverse video footage of the voyage and penguins and seeing the whales from above in many split screens spiraling around. Another wonderful element of the film was a mesmerizing voice of the narrator, so slow and resonant and serene. I want to see more from this group, like of the Drake Passage story, which was mentioned near the end. I want to commend the cinematography right off the bat. You, you make it very clear that, like, it we're not even capturing the full beauty of of the arctic and um and even still it's it's incredibly mesmerizing to look at it 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 truly is beautiful so i really want to commend that um on top of that i think there's some fun transitions that you get i think there are um just different ways that you edited um the filming that you did get and to make it really interesting to watch with the different movement um of the different animals and non-animals, uh, just everything coming together. I think this was incredibly informative about the beauty and about the origin uh, of of all the wildlife in the Arctic and um, just how it's been preserved over the years. The cinematography brings just a wide view of this part of the universe I think seeing the uh, boats ride through the ice paths are quite serene and the, the music that is uh, supervised within this piece is, gives a relaxing essence and you know you find yourself sort of at peace in the bay as we are going and seeing this uh, you know viewpoint with just the mixture of just humanity and nature uh, coming together. I just love the, the, the way you broke it up into two parts, the beauty and then the Antarctic circle. I, I liked that a lot. It was easy to follow. There was a lot of information, just beautiful to watch. I could just watch it over and over just for the scenery, um, the landscape the penguins. I love how you guys, to me, this is really creative filmmaking because it was very interesting how you put the penguins going into the water. You reversed it in the beginning and in the end, you showed them going in the water. And same with the boat. I noticed you did that with the boat, kind of reversed it going backwards, which was a cool effect actually. And then you showed it going forward at the end, just all around great footage, great information, um, really well done. You know, seeing the glaciers and the glacial waters, it's almost like watching the, the, the beginning of a, of a Ridley Scott movie or something. You know, it was just a breathtaking. The, the photography was, was, was wonderful, you know, and having the narrative broken up into the beauty and the dangers, you know, that was a really good idea to give it shape and really, it gave us a sense of story rather than just fact giving, you know? uh there were there was a story that was delivering the facts and the information to us which is very nice um yeah now the most astounding part to me was when he, he says oh, we encountered a lot of ice we had to cut through the ice you know and we're seeing this high high up aerial footage of the, of the ships they're just cutting through the ice i mean i was just like they actually got footage of this as it was happening you know 
uh, they were able to send up a drone and or whatever and, and and get this and get this to happen as they're in the middle of all this danger that was very brave you know so this is a very brave uh film um you know quite an undertaking you know the uh everything it took to make this film you know the filmmaking itself is just a small piece of it you know that there's like the getting on the boats and being able to and sailing and enduring all of this so great job i'm glad we now have the ability and technology to explore these lands even though it is quite risky but i hope we also develop ways to preserve them faster and yep so we can keep looking at them and keep being proud of what nature brought us um, they also give us this great view of whales from the top how they group together and create these formations that are almost um, poetical they look so good I, I never thought I would look at whales as a, a, an work of art it's great and also loved looking at the penguins at this icy paradise